Hey students, in this short video lesson, I will introduce and cover some of the basics of the concept known as in la cache. So let's dive right in. In la cache is a Mayan precept, precept meaning a rule or ordinance in which the Mayan culture live their daily lives. Honestly though, in la cache is more than just a rule. It was a way of living. The Mayan people didn't practice in la cache, they were in la cache. They implemented in la cache in every aspect of their lives, their culture, and their overall way of living and being. In la cache is translated into two main connotations that can vary, but they usually go along the lines as, you are my other me, or I am your other you. It is the same or very similar to saying namaste, which the people of the Indian culture use, meaning I bow to you, or the light in me honors the light in you. Also, the translations of in la quech are commonly mentioned in Spanish and reads and sounds like tu eres mi otro yo, or yo soy otro tu. There's actually a short poem that teacher and scholar Luis Valdez was inspired to write, and it reads as follows. Tú eres mi otro yo. You are my other me. Si te hago daño a ti, if I do harm to you, me hago daño a mí mismo. I do harm to myself. Si te amo y respeto, if I love and respect you, me amo y respeto yo. I love and respect myself. This here is a link to a video that shows Luis Valdez beginning his class with a recitation of the poem. It's a quick and fun watch. Ultimately, in la quech is more than a phrase or a greeting. It is a way of life and a lifestyle. It is the epitome of what today we know and say as treat others how you want to be treated. One cannot simply choose certain times to implement in la quech into their life. In la quech has to be one's life. Can you find another proverb that relates to in la quech or has similar meanings? It does not have to be from the Mayan culture. It can be from any culture or any person. Please note, namaste is already used in this short lesson. So try to find another. And yes, guys, there are others out there. We will be going over what you found on your own time in class. So please come prepared. So students, I suggest like you get like some eggs and start cracking on this short assignment. Good luck.